Welcome back, guys, to Oblivion. This is part 11. Probably oh, my last part. I'm on the final missions of the main quest. Destroy the, the big ass gate. It'll be fun. So I have to go to a temple, heal myself, so I can actually regain magic. It's a greetings. Desperate plan indeed. This prince? Emperor? Martin would risk my whole city to gain a great sigil stone? This is the only way to stop this invasion from oblivion? I must confess, you are the first person to speak of victory against these Daedra. This war has seemed hopeless to me. But what else was there to do but hold on and wait for a hero to arrive? And now it seems there is an heir to the throne after all, hidden at Cloud Ruler Temple. And perhaps a hero as well? You avoid answering my question. Very well. Don't think I doubt you. The rulers of Bruma have long had dealings with Cloud Ruler Temple. We know whom they serve. I will meet Martin at the chapel. When all is ready... Let's do it. I'll come to the chapel with you. Slow as fuck. to see you. Stats, bro. Holy shit. I'm one powerful motherfucker, that's for sure. Your Highness, I am Narina Carvain, Countess of Bruma, at your service. There is no need for any formality at this time. I am not Emperor yet, and I am quite new to this notion of being heir to the throne. Thank you for coming. I know I am asking for a great deal of trust, but this is the only way. I would not suggest it otherwise. 
Your champion has already explained the situation to me. I have agreed to it. We will not win this war through caution. You have a rare gift to know when desperation is the path of wisdom. I will do everything in my power to defend your city, my lady. If Bruma falls, the Empire falls with us. So be it. I will call out my militia if necessary, but must we truly stand alone? So be it. Bruma's fate is in the hands of the gods now. We'll do it. And yours. Bird, deploy the troops for battle. As you command, Countess. We're about to fucking destroy everything. None of these fuckers are going to stand a chance with me. Not an easy. Uh, gold burn, 22 damage, 14 for 2 seconds. That's 28 damage. 23, 23. Sword of Crusader, honestly, is better. In the end, Sword of the Crusader is better comes to pure damage per second. Let's do it. Great, great to oblivion. Ooh. I didn't realize that. I ain't got no fucking arrows. Oh, yeah, I do. Never mind. Yeah. Martin Septim! Hail Martin Septim! Martin 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 Go destroy the ship. I'm not even gonna let you guys die, bro. Like. On home. <coughs> I ain't worried about it. Why aren't you in armor, bird? It's what? Ten people? Plus. Five, fifteen people? That's not bad. Soldiers of Cyrodiil, the Empire will stand or fall by what we do here today. Will we let the Daedra do to Bruma what they did to Kavach? Will we let them burn our homes? Will we let them kill our families? No! 
we make our stand here today for the whole of Cyrodiil. We must hold fast until the hero of Kavach can destroy their great gate. We must kill whatever comes out of that gate. Soldiers of Cyrodiil, do you stand with me? Bring it on. Damn, teammate shot you right for that. <laughs> Gotta fix that, dude. My place is on the battlefield. The time for hiding. Hmm. Let's wait.
give Martin the list. I'll go and get to her. Let's go get some allies, bro. Cause like I didn't realize that there was that many. Even on easy, like there's just so many. Uh. Even on easy. Well, that was insane. I am Melona Umbran. I would like to send help to Bruma, but I can't. Still. Farewell. Hi there. It is a privilege. Get of oblivion.
really? Oh. I've seen two of them. I swear to God, I saw two of them on the way back to Z1. Gets to oblivion, piss me off, bro. the other fucking side. What the hell? Same fucking side. God damn it. There needs, there needed to be a levitate in this fucking game. Really needed to be. We passed all this dumbass shit.
Okay, great. Another one. Awesome. No idea where I'm going. How do you even get past this, bro? You ain't getting up there. <coughs> Waste of oblivion. Waste of oblivion. Okay, yeah. I would rather just fucking do do it this way. And then not get my ass kicked all the whole fucking time. I would spend another three hours on this fucking shit. And I would just rather just... Martin! 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 Why do I want my teammates get to die? God damn it. I'd rather just do it this way. It's easier. Yeah, you know, a lot of people are gonna die, but. Of the time to go through another eight oblivion gates. All are gonna take an hour each. Like, fuck you. Sucks that every single one of these. We got 15 people here. And they're all gonna die that simply? That easy? Well, you get hit once and you're fucking dead. You suck. All of you suck. Soldiers of Cyrodiil, the Empire will stand or fall by what we do here today. Will we let the Daedra do to Bruma what they did to Kavach? Will we let them burn our homes? We will let them kill our families? No, we make our stand here today for the whole of Cyrodiil. We must hold fast until the hero of Kavach can destroy their great gate. We must kill Whatever comes out of that gate, 
soldiers of Cyrodiil, do you stand with me? Bring it on, motherfucker. Not be a fucking idiot. I'm going to save it right at the fucking entrance of the battlefield. Who's the Emperor? Jesus Christ. Who's the Emperor? 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 Mm, you suck, Martin. <clears throat> you struck down in three blows. Oh my bird, ain't even got any fucking armor on. Saving it right after his stupid ass speech. It's ridiculous. They all get killed in one hit. Including Martin. Soldiers of Cyrodiil, the Empire will stand or fall by what we do here today. Will we let the Daedra do to Bruma what they did to Kavach? Will we let them burn our homes? Will we let them kill our families? No, we make our stand here today for the home of Cyrodiil. We must hold fast until the hero of Kavach can destroy their great gate. We must kill whatever comes out of that gate. So Of Cyrodiil, do you stand with me? This guy got his fists? What the? Martin been slain. Why did he get fucking killed? Who the fuck did he get killed by? Who? You need to stay back, dude. Your worst. Your. Here comes another one. 
sign again. That's ridiculous, dude. Why aren't these people doing anything? Attack! Part of that shit. Open the fucking gate. Oh 
Oh my god. All three of those things, bro. Holy, holy shit. died, Joffrey died, everybody fucking died. There ain't shit you can do about it either. These guys fucking suck. We won a great victory here today. We now have the means to recover the Amulet of Kings from Manka Cameron. But we need to act quickly. Cap, remember, the portal closes behind you. I'll have the ritual ready in the Great Hall. Go. Farewell, my friend. Suck. Try my best, bro. Even that was not enough. Not enough.
Everyone just got fucked. Stupid. I wanted Boris to stay alive, but apparently he's not going to. That's fine. Day. Armor, weapons, I have it all. How may I help you? <sighs> That's a, a good price for a good customer. I can fit. You too. Wait, I need arrows. Welcome to a. F what can I interest you in? A fine bargain for you. You're a fine. Thank. Goodbye. Bullshit. <clears throat> I have everything in place. I, I do. I believe that Manka Cameron acts as the anchor for paradise, just as a sigil stone. Kill Manka Cameron. Shall I open the portal to? Farewell, my friend. Our <coughs> fate is in your hands. Bring back the amulet of kings. Brace yourself. Let's do it. So, the cat's paw of the septim arrives at last. You didn't think you could take me unawares or places in the paradise that I created. Look now upon my paradise. Gaia Alata in the old tongue. A vision of the past and the future. Honestly, Morrowind is Morrowind is more fun. Behold the savage garden, where my disciples are tempered for a higher destiny, to rule over Tamriel. If you are truly the hero of destiny, as I hope, the garden will not hold you for long. Lift your eyes to Kerek Agaya. <laughs> My seat at the pinnacle of paradise. I shall await you there. Come on. Where do I go?
Okay, yeah, don't tell me where to go whatsoever. That's annoying. It's really annoying. So you found your way to Gaia a lot. Leave us alone. You're... Leave me in peace. Story's better. Everything about Marlin was pretty much better. Some of the combat was just been looking about it. You destroyed the Sigil Tower at Gonona. You speak directly, like one of my people almost. I'm glad I There is but one way out of the garden. I guard that path. You will travel that path, and it will bring me honor to defeat you. But you shamed my kin at Canona to bring you into my... So I offer you a choice. Would you confront me in battle, or offer me service? Your mind follows the simple path, the choice... You will fail, mortal. And then, where will you- Let's fight this guy on normal. See what you're fucking made of, bitch. How little you understand. You cannot stop, Lord Dagon. The Principalities have sparkled as gems in the black reaches of oblivion since the first morning. Many are their names and the names of their masters. The cold harbor of Meridia. Periites... And Dawn's Beauty. The princedom of Lorcon, misnamed Tamriel by deluded mortals. You fucked around with the wrong person today, homie. Yes, you understand now. Tamriel is just one more Daedric realm of oblivion, long since lost to its prince when he was betrayed by those that served. <laughs> Lord Dagon cannot invade Tamriel, his birthright. He comes to liberate the occupied lands. Ask yourself, how is it that mighty gods die, yet the Daedra stand incorruptible? How is it that the Daedra forthrightly proclaim themselves to man, while the gods cower behind statues and the faithless words of traitor? It is simple. They are not gods at all. The truth has been in front of you since... You first... Julie 
Dianos, Dibella, and Stondar are all Lorcan's betrayers, posing as divinities in the principality that has lost its guiding light. What our scholarship, love, and mercy when compared to fate, dear night, that and the best you can do? The gods you worship are trifling shadows and causes. They have changed. Why do you think your world has always been contested ground, the arena of powers and immortals? It is time to the realm of change, brother to madness, sister to deceit. Your false gods could not entirely rewrite it. Thus you remember tales of Lorcan vilified, a Dorchester whose heart... Art came to But if a god can die, how does his heart survive? He is Daedroth! Tamri Eli Daedroth! This heart is the heart of the world, for one was made to satisfy the other. You all remember this. It is in every legend. Daedra cannot die. You wear the bands, but you're no prisoner. Can you really do it? Can you bring Can you defeat Mankar Cameron and free all the souls of the poor fools who followed him? Listen, I can help you. You need my help if you are ever to leave the f I was at the sack of Kvach. They had no chance. We took them by surprise, and we carried the walls in the first assault. But they fought on anyway, desperately. They seemed to think this decadent, mundane world of theirs was worth defending. I was slain after the battle was over. Three townsfolk hiding in the cellar attacked me when I entered their house, hunting down survivors. They tore me to pieces, although I have no doubt they were immediately killed by my... I've had plenty of time to ponder my deed since I came here. Ponder for my weakness. The master sent me. No one wearing the bands of the Chosen can leave this grotto. The doors will not open, and there is no other way out. I can remove them, but I will need time. The Dremora Overseer will be here any minute to check up on me. You need to play along and just act like a prisoner and do as I say. Once Orthe leaves, we can find a quiet spot to remove these. Good. Follow me and. What's going on here? Who's this? A prisoner sent in by. Show me some respect, worm. Unless you want to end up in the cages with them. Yes, Kinreeve, sir. This prisoner was sent in by Cathetet for questioning. I was about to begin. This is not one of Mankar Cameron's chattels from the garden. Who is he? Nothing escapes your vigilance, Kinreeve. Cathetet wondered as well. This is why he sent him for questioning. Of course, Kinreeve. Prisoner, get in the cage! There's no way for me to cross, but the Master's immortality does have its uses. I will distract the Dramora for as long as I can.
old brand don't do much anymore. It's still at 80, bro. Like, what the heck? across this way. <clears throat> I didn't think you'd have any trouble. Let there. You're not a. Let me come with you. Let me help you kill Mankar Cameron. I am not without power. I am no match for Mankar Cameron, but perhaps together we can find a way to defeat him. Well done, champion. Your progress is swift and sure. Perhaps you will reach me after all. You think I mock you? Not at all. In your coming, I hear the footsteps of fate. You are the last defender of decadent Tamriel. I am the midwife of the mythic dawn, Tamriel Reborn. I welcome you, if you truly are the agent of fate. I tire of the self-styled heroes who set themselves in my path only to prove 
unworthy in the event. Put an end. We working on it. So normal, I'm fucking destroying these people. It takes a long time, but I'm still fucking them up.
sorry, y'all. They took you down. So, he you should not keep my father waiting any longer. He expected you hours ago. Come, you came here to see him. Just killed you. That's great. <clears throat> Came for the amulet? Take it then. Okay. Die! 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 Worthy! 
Like, what do I got to do? Fifteen, twenty. My arm is broken. on normal right sure did fuck me I'd use some poisons you found a way back does this mean you did it you defeated him then you have it you have the amulet of kings belongs to me the amulet of kings so you and Joffrey have said, if it is true, if the Emperor really was my father, then I should be able to wear it. Only those of the Septim blood can wear the Amulet of Kings. Yes, of course. What am I waiting for? After all, this is my destiny. And no man can deny his destiny. I didn't really need the amulet to tell me that. I've known it was true since you first told me him back in Kavach. But it is one thing to talk of becoming emperor, and quite another to actually be the emperor. Not yet. Until we light the dragon fires, the gates are open, and Mayroon's Dagon's invasion continues. While you were gone, I sent a messenger to Chancellor Ricardo. He was. Chancellor Ricardo is the head of the Elder Council. The Council rules in the Emperor's absence. I don't expect any objections from the Elder Council, but we should def Let's go to the Imperial City at once, before the enemy can recover from Manka Cameron's death. Congratulations on your victory, sir. Hey. Six four said to die. <laughs> Tried to keep him alive. Hold on, Martin. Sire. Let's continue on. Let's continue on to the Elder Council Chambers. Well then, let's go. It's not like we got much time, homie. Ah, uh, damn. 
Welcome to the Imperial Palace. Damn. That's a big motherfucking... I've been expecting you. The full council has already considered the matter of Martin's claim to the Imperial throne in deep. Martin Septim, on behalf of the Elder Council, I accept your claim to the Imperial throne. We should Chancellor Okado, the city is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened and Daedra are inside the walls. The guard is overwhelmed. Courage, soldier. We have an emperor again. Your Highness, what are your orders? Shall the guard fall back to the palace? No. If we let ourselves get besieged in the palace, we're doomed. We must get to the Temple of the One immediately. As you command, sire. Guards, form up and protect the Emperor. To the Temple of the One. To get to the Temple of the One, it's our Mayroon's. Let's go, dude. Put the center around for. Lost like three of our homes there. Too late, Mayroon's lighting the dragon fires will no longer save us. The barriers that protected us from oblivion are gone. I don't see how. Mortal weapons may hurt him, but now that he is physically here in Tamriel, they have no power to actually destroy him. 
Wait, yes. The amulet was given to mortals by Akatosh. It contains his divine power. But how to use this power against Dagon? The amulet was not intended as a weapon. I have an idea, one last hope. I must reach the Dragonfires and the Temple of the One. You'll just have to trust me. I know now what I was born to do, but I'll need your help. I have to get past. Then I'll do. Lead on. I'm. I do what I must do. I cannot stay to rebuild Tamriel. That task falls to others. Farewell. You've been a good friend in the short time that I've known you. But now I must go. is shattered. Dagon is defeated. With the dragon's blood and the amulet of kings, we have sealed the gates of oblivion forever. The last of the Septims passes now into history. I go gladly, for I know my sacrifice is not in vain. I take my place with my father and my father's fathers. The Third Age has ended, and a new age dawns. When the next Elder Scroll is written, you shall be its scribe. The shape of the future, the fate of the Empire. These things, now, belong to you. <sighs> what happened? Where's Martin? I must congratulate him. Mayroon's Dagon is defeated. Cast back into oblivion. We've won! What do you mean, gone? We saw the temple dome explode. The avatar of Akatosh appear. That was Martin? The joined blood of kings and gods. The amulet of kings. The divine power of Akatosh. Then, Martin is gone. Yes, sealed forever. Merun's Dagon and his ilk can never threaten Tamriel again. Martin is dead, but he died an emperor and a hero to rival Tiber Septim. This victory is not without cost. We've lost Martin Septim. What an emperor he might have made. His sacrifice was necessary, but it leaves the empire without an emperor. I don't know what happens now. There are troubled times ahead for the empire. But now is not the time to worry about the future. Let's just give thanks that we're alive. In my capacity as Lord High Chancellor of the Elder Council, I hereby proclaim you Champion of Cyrodiil! And, 
as a small token of gratitude for your service to the Empire, I have ordered a suit of Imperial Dragon armor made for you. Imperial Dragon armor is normally worn only by the Emperor himself, but you deserve no less, Champion. You have earned the highest rank possible in the... It is a high honor. I know he's gone. As the Chancellor of the Elder Council, my concern now is how to choose his successor. We are now the stewards of the Empire. We can hold the Empire together in the short term. But to be honest, I don't know what will happen. The provinces have been restive for years, even before the latest crisis. With no legitimate claimant for the Dragon Throne, troubled times lie ahead. The Dragon will stand forever as a memorial to what you and Martin did for all of Tamriel. Hmm. Yeah. We did it. It's around normal too. And it wasn't the easiest thing in the world either. Mundane ring is just absolutely insane. Wow, all right, well. Okay. I can't believe it's over. That giant demon, the dragon, what happened? Have we won? Oh, well, we won, home. My children are starving, please. I can eat. Are you looking? I think I trust you. To learn more about the Grey Fox, go to the Garden of Dereloth at midnight. Look in the wall. <clears throat> Blessings of Anu upon ye. Alright. Jesus. Oh, I don't feel like that took a long, as long as Morrowind, but... I also wanted to do the Thieves Guild and Shivering Isles. I need to take a break from Elder Scrolls. I really do. Ugh. Uh. <sighs> Alright, guys. That's Oblivion. Did you see it? Did the you? avatar of Akatosh himself? Yeah, yeah, I know. There I it is. is. Come on, come on. The monument to our deliverance. Thanks, guys, for watching. It's been incredible playing this. I love Oblivion. I'll consider playing the Thieves Guild and Shivering Isles later. <clears throat> Like I said, I need a, I need a break. But either way, I appreciate the views. I appreciate you watching, joining me. I will see you on the next one.